holding on a cigarette He's in the skies deep in the dark And in a mix he knows the mark Welcome back to the Juicy Vapor Channel. What's up, yo? Word up! It's E-Juice Review Time. And we are reviewing a flavor called Dr. Peppercorn. Right? Dr. Peppercorn. And it's put out by Central Vapors. Uh, this is a uh, 30 PG to 70 VG ratio. My particular nicotine preference is 3 milligrams, so that's what's in there. Hopefully you can see that. I did uh, some retooling of my camera, so I hope they're a little more clear and you get a better shot. Uh, we're also a dual screen, so you can see me working instead of pausing and then going to an overshot video. Uh, so back to what we're doing. Dr. Peppercorn. Woohoo! 30 PG to 70 VG mix put out by Central Vapors. Uh, I'll put their information, a direct link for this product, down below when, when the video is over. Uh, again, 3 milligram nicotine by volume, my personal preference. But we will put the link directly to the product down below. By the way, please like and subscribe. I appreciate it. Everybody, if you can help me get to a 1,000 followers to start on my YouTube, I will be doing my first giveaway when we do that. So, let's get back to Dr. <laughs> Pause for station identification break. <sighs> All right. Today we're going to be using my Lassimo or Lassimo. Uh, it's a pretty cool machine. This here has got Bluetooth. You can set the settings on your on your your smartphone pretty cool it's a 200 watt machine also using a baby beast tank uh, by smock or smoke whatever so that's what we'll be using go ahead and tank out tape tank man I'm just tongue-tied today we're gonna go ahead and take off the tank and we're gonna go ahead and get it started and what a dummy I am I forgot this has a top side fill so what I did was just you know rookie mistake it happens I'm just all over the place today because I had a lot to do and being disabled makes it even harder to get around and do things uh, but I'm not one of those guys that just just likes to stay still and not do anything. Just because I'm disabled does not mean that I can't do things sometimes. <laughs> All right. It's got a topside fill. Uh, you saw me just kind of cleaning it off there. Um, yeah. I don't know why I did that. Anyway, what I like about these bottles from Central Vapor is instead of the traditional um the traditional little tinctures it's got that little plastic nozzle up there so it's pretty good for using these small little little um yeah right there you see that for doing those small little holes to fill up the uh, e-juice and boom already filled up check it out that's cool What we're going to do, I had already in advance put a little tiny bit in there just so we could get the, the wick uh, making contact with the juice so that we don't get dry fire. Uh, I'm not even going to go down that road. If you watched any one of my videos, you'll know dry fire. If you can take the few extra steps ahead of time, you'll reduce dry firing and the... Uh, how many wicks you have to use dry fire for me that's an automatic change of wick so anyway we'll leave it at that mm. 
What I'm going to do now is smell it. Ah. Wow. I think the name of this thing kind of says it all. Uh, man. That's pretty close right there. Dr. Peppercorn, get it? I'm taking some suctions to further draw that ju the juice through the wick. That's what I'm doing there. Uh, okay, so I've got this. Even though it's 200 watts, I'm setting it at 70. That's kind of the sweet spot for this tank and coil. Um, just because it says it can do 200 watts doesn't mean you automatically should. I would find a nice sweet spot with your coil. Always look at your coil. Uh, if your coil says 100 watts, don't try to push it at 100 watts. It's just my particular preference. I like to put it somewhere between 70 and 80. That way you're not maxing it out. You know what I mean? All right, we're going to go ahead and hit that fire button right there. Wow. Anybody who knows me or if you've watched these videos before from me, uh, I love drink taste and flavor taste above all things. And this is really remarkably close. You know, I think it would be right there if somebody put... If you figured out a way to put carbonation in it, yeah. Let's go ahead and roll it around the mouth and get all the, get everything going and, and get engage all your taste buds. That is remarkable. That is remarkable. I've had, um, similar flavors from other companies um, but I don't think they quite taste like this this is pretty remarkable and and in the way that I'm saying is the flavor and the consistency after the fact and and I love Dr. Pepper soda um, this is kind of like a cross between like a cola and Dr. Pepper and again the only thing missing maybe is uh, is the carbonation what I might try to do and I'll do it in a separate uh, video I might actually pull out some cherry e-juice and maybe try a tank of cherry and Dr. Pepper and uh, as a matter of fact I even have some cream uh, flavored e-juice so I might go down that road uh, that's how good this is I, I think you think it would do really really well uh, maybe if I if I introduce some different flavors, and I can see myself vaping on this flavor all day. This is one of those that you can do all day. All right, once again, uh, we are going through Central Vapors put out this, uh, this flavor, Dr. Peppercorn. It's got a 30 PG to 70 VG mix and again three milligram nicotine by volume is my personal preference uh, I'll put the link down below so you can get right on over to the product I'll also copy and paste the details down below so uh, if you don't want to go over to the link you right right away you can see the description right there uh, once more please like and subscribe tell all your friends if there's something you want to see me review let me know. Uh, I think my Twitter and email, uh, I'm sorry, yeah, email address is down below. Um, so I'm very easy to get a hold of. And if you guys can help me get to 1,000 subscribers, I will do my first giveaway. All right. And it'll be a substantial giveaway. Probably going to be a mod in a tank and a, I don't know. But I'll, I'll figure it out. All right, guys, I know you guys got things to do, so we're going to get on out of here in traditional Juicy Vapor style. Later.
holding on a cigarette He's in the skies deep in the dark And in a mix he knows the mark <laughs> 